Hi there, it's Jim from Janku with an Olive tutorial. Today I want to take a look at creating a green screen effect using the alpha version of Olive. So let's go over here to Firefox and let's go to a website called pexels.com and let's make sure that we're on the video section here. I'm going to do forward slash videos and here I'm going to search for green screen. And let's just grab one of these videos with a green screen. I like this one of this girl in business attire here. So let's grab this video here. I'm going to grab the free download. Thank you, Wolfgang. This is a great video. I'm going to save that. And now let's just think about superimposing this girl into an office setting. So let's search for an office video. And this blurry office here is fine. Let's just grab this and let's grab this free download save the file here okay so now let's go into our olive editor and let's just import these videos I'm going to right click in my project section I'm going to import and for my downloads I'm going to hold down shift and I'm going to click to select both these videos and press open and then I'm just going to select them both and drag them onto my timeline we have our blurry office here first and then we have this second video over here afterwards now this video is quite large, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to select it and then under my transform effects I'm going to go to the scale and I'm going to start scaling this down and it looks like somewhere around 50% is the exact scale for this screen, so I'm going to put it at 50% and then I'm just going to overlay this video over the other one, so I'm going to grab my video track, I'm going to pull it up and I'm going to drag it over so this is overlaying the blurry video. Now we don't need the audio track that's associated with this, so we can delete that by pressing Control L to ungroup these two tracks. And then if I click off and I just click the bottom, it selects only the audio track and I can just press delete now to get rid of that. Okay, so now back at the beginning here, we have this girl with the green screen. If we play it, you can see she's there. And what I can do is I can select this track and now I can add an effect. So under video effects, I can click this icon here and I can go to keying and select the chroma key effect. Now, since we're in the composite mode, we can just play with this lower tolerance toggle here until we get it to the point where we can see the background image below it. So you notice if I bump up to 40, that looks fine. Let's play this video. Well, you can see some green in the motion of her hands when she's moving. So I probably bump this up to something higher. Let's try something like 55. And then let's come back to the beginning and play this. So that looks pretty good. I think my computer has a little bit of delay since uh, this is a quite a large video and we're playing two of them on top of each other with some effects. But essentially this is giving you the green screen effect. Hopefully that's helpful and gets you started with doing some green screening in Olive. If you like these tutorials, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more content in the future. Thanks for watching. Bye.